Hey guys, I had a fellow racer ask me, uh, he heard me, he overheard me talking to another racer about polishing the gears, the pinion and the spur on uh, my Tomy AFX cars, the Mega G's, Super G's, uh, Mega G Plus, so on and so forth, um, any slot car really. Um, I use this um, just a little bit, um, put it on with a toothpick, just a dab. Um, on the spur gear and the pinion and I run the car at low voltage for about an hour and a half to two hours and then I pop the rear axle out of the car and uh, you know clean everything up nice nice and it just helps polish the gear mesh uh, polish the gears and um, really I, I think it makes a big difference in the way that the gears mesh. Uh, any imperfections in the gears um, from the manufacturing process is usually um, taken care of, if not removed altogether. So it's a real fine paste. I put a little bit of it there. And um, when you rub it between your fingers, you can barely feel any grit at all. Um, I've heard people say, you know, use toothpaste or something. I don't recommend using toothpaste. But Simichrome polish, it's made by Hapik. It's imported, um, I believe it's made in Germany. But um, I just wanted to share that with you real quick. I'll put a link in the description below where you can find some for yourself. But like I said, all you need is a little bit on the spur and the pinion. I think some of the T-Jet guys, um, they may run it on the, or the Magna Traction chassis, you know, anything with a pancake motor. Um, you can put a little bit on those gears too and run that at low voltage also to help polish up those, uh, clean up the gear mesh and um, get everything just nice, nice and really give you a little uh, racer's edge. So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching the video. We'll see you next time.